Hi everyone, Cosmic Scale Models back again. This time with a, an unboxing video for the Delta Flyer interior kit. So as you see it's well packaged as usual. And inside Lots and lots of parts in this one. So we've got this is a replacement canopy for the cockpit. Um, you discard the original cockpit that came with the kit and use this one. Um, the, the main difference is it has this roll bar section, uh, which also helps to light block. Um, any light coming from the interior of the ship and it also has some interior detail so that's that part and the main tub for the cockpit so you, you've got the cockpit area here, and then this would be the midsection and then you've got the, the cargo bay area at the end I put these reinforcements on so that it doesn't uh, warp. Uh, resin does, that, does have a tendency of warping. <laughs> so that, should, that has cut down on uh, any warping issues that you might uh, come across. If you do have any warping, the best thing to do is put this part in hot, in hot water for a few few moments and then clamp it flat somewhere and it, it that does the uh, does the trick usually works with any resin so that's the main tub and then we've got lots and lots of parts over 40 parts in this we've got two large bags of clear parts and then two smaller bags of other parts I'll get a few pieces out just to show you won't get everything out Part that goes in the midsection. Lots of detail. Everything's designed with lighting in mind, so you know. Feel free to light this kit up. Um, I certainly will do one when I get around to building a kit for myself. A couple of cockpit chairs there. We get four of these, of course. an optional uh, boarding ladder for the rear you'll see in the instructions where this where this part goes it was never actually shown on the show uh, but searching the in internet for inspiration I found lots of uh, ideas and concepts regarding how people would uh, access the rear of the ship Crew figures. We've got a door. Some nice detail on there. It's a long way up actually. <laughs> and then to the clear parts. I say clear that they are they're frosted so that does help with the light dispersal these are some parts from the uh, 
cargo bay area. This is the medical section. The med bed goes and slots into this this bit here. And you've also got holes in the top to put either uh, fiber optics or small LEDs for lighting those sections up. You can always put a light behind and light up any decals that go on here. This is the main bulkhead wall between the cockpit and the and the midsection. It's actually that way around. And you have the warp core that sits in there. This is the main control panel which sits at right at the front of the ship. It sits in there, like so. That's where Tom Paris would uh, pilot the ship from. Bag of tiny parts. I won't get all these out. But, uh, there are spares for some parts because they're so tiny. Um, I put spares in just in case uh, you lose them. So you see lots and lots of parts. There's been a lot of work gone into this kit. This it's um, you've got a clear acetate, which is the cage for the, uh, the cargo bay storage area. You've got this storage area that goes in. This piece cuts out and then goes in, slots in behind, and gives you a cage effect. It's actually that way. Put it in behind there. So you just cut that out and then glue it to the back of this once you've painted it. And then you've got some plastic backlight film which you can cut squares out of and make your own skylights for these skylight sections. So you can light behind it and it gives you a nice diffused lighting effect. You've got more than enough there to uh, to use on the kit. The decal sheet. The decal system that I have doesn't allow you to print the white behind colour. So what I do is print the white on as a separate decal. So you put that decal on first, let it dry, and then you put the other part on top. So we can we can do white decals. This, this section here is the uh, the walk core. decal sheet and the uh, instruction booklet it's a 12 page booklet <laughs> and uh, it's had to be 12 pages because of the amount of uh, parts in this kit I'll just give you a quick flip through. you can download this from my website or on Facebook uh, it's a free download. Lots and lots of work going into this instruction booklet, as you can see. As for painting, um, I've given a few suggestions, but Really, it's down to you. I've given you a colour palette to use, and um, at the back of the book, a couple of screens.
screenshots just to give you an idea lots of leathers and browns and tans and greys instructions I right. hope you enjoy the kit um, as I said lot, been lots of work going into this um, and I hope you enjoy it thanks for watching